Guys, have you ever wondered why I have a one dollar bill on fire in the background? No kidding. Have you ever wondered why most people buy at this exact top and most people sell at the exact bottom? And have you ever wondered why the price actually at the certain top rolls over while everyone is bullish and why at the bottom when everyone is extremely bearish why the price then suddenly goes up well this is something that most people in the markets don't understand and i'm going to try and explain to you this very simple in today's video because this this might be one of the most important things for you to realize in the markets because if you gain this knowledge this perspective it will give you a better understanding of what is driving the price and what is making that the price is starting to reverse. Okay, guys, so let's dive straight into it. If you want to support this channel, make sure to scroll below this video and smash up this like button because every single one deserves to get this knowledge for free. That is very, very important. And yeah, guys, let's dive straight into it. And guys, it's actually very, very logical. Listen to what I'm saying right here. If everyone is bullish, right? The world has a certain population and a certain amount of people that are interested in that specific asset. If you talk about Bitcoin, 100% of the world is not going to go into Bitcoin. Just like 100% of the world is not going to invest into oil. Right, there's always a percentage of the global population that feels that resonation with a certain asset and therefore drives through that asset with its liquidity, right? So I want to take Bitcoin for example because we are focused right here on the Bitcoin markets. If everyone that potentially can be bullish on Bitcoin is bullish on Bitcoin, then those people who are bullish and who are euphoric they most likely have already positioned themselves into a Bitcoin position, right? So that means that they are already positioned into their bullish bias. So when every single one who potentially is a Bitcoin buyer, a Bitcoin investor is bullish on Bitcoin, right? Then the price of course goes up because everyone has already positioned themselves in Bitcoin. But the market cap of Bitcoin is increasing as well. So to increase for the price of Bitcoin, we continuously need more and more liquidity. But now comes the catch guys if everyone is so is if everyone is bullish if everyone is already positioned in bitcoin everyone bought already then where does that new liquidity come from and this is very uh, confusing for many people because a lot of people will always make this argument hey but if everyone is bullish if everyone believes in bitcoin the price will go up right no it's the exact opposite because when everyone is bullish Everyone positioned themselves already in Bitcoin, which means that all liquidity is already in the asset. And what do we have left in the markets? We only have sellers left. And this is a very simple way of looking at the markets. I got a phone call from someone I love very, very much. And he called me when Dogecoin was pumping. And Dogecoin had, I think, already a billion dollar, maybe even multi-billion uh, dollar market cap. And he'd, he'd ask me, hey, should I invest in Dogecoin? And I asked him this question. Okay, look at the market cap of Dogecoin. It's multi-billion. I don't know the exact number, but it's a multi-billion market cap. For you to double your investment, the same amount of billions that are already in this market cap needs to flow in to double the price of your investment. Where is that liquidity is going to come from? Ask yourself that question because that's very important. And the, most of the time, the answer is liquidity is not there. Liquidity is not there. So we are going to a point where everyone is positioned in the markets till we reach that point that the liquidity is so high that we cannot top that anymore and all the market participants are bullish and are already positioned, which eventually reach that turning point. And then slowly, all the buyers that already positioned start slowly to sell. And it starts often with smart money, 
they selling aggressively in the bear market and then later on the bear market when the whole uh, sentiment is very pessimistic and very negative and nobody believes anymore in bitcoin we also call that the weak hands then those are the ones that selling they sell at the bottom and they buy at the top because they are prone to human emotional influences and if you can take that step back and realize how the markets really work then you would have acted differently because if we are at the bottom think about this guys if we are at the bottom we have an ftx crash multiple exchanges crashes luna went to zero all the confidence is out of the markets it's gone it's nowhere in the neighborhood it means all the weak hands have sold Everyone that wants to sell or had a, is like not so confident in Bitcoin already sold. So what do you have left in the markets? Well, the people that are inside Bitcoin, that are the true believers. If you don't sell after a 80% correction, if you don't sell after Luna going to zero, if you don't sell when the news talks about Bitcoin is dead again, if you don't sell when one of the biggest exchanges crashes to zero FTX, then those are diamond hands. They form the fundamental bottom and the only market participants that are out there or the majority, they are not positions in Bitcoin, which means they are potential buyers. So this really makes so much sense, guys, that at the top, when everyone is in the asset, they cannot buy anymore because they already positioned that drove the price up, which eventually reached a turning point, which also happens when the price corrects, right? Somewhat all the sellers are gone, which leaves that the majority of the potential market participants, so the potential of Bitcoin investors, are out of the markets, which are all potential buyers who could enter. So that is also why it's so important to recognize the emotional state. And that is also why it's so important that we on this channel could call the exact bottom based on time and based on sentiment because we can just see okay based on time we had the one year bear market we had a 80 percent correction from the all-time high we do see the sentiment is completely crushed time to go all in and this happens on a macro perspective which might be a little bit easier recognizable also in the charts that i'm showing right here on the channel but it also happens in the shorter term time frames why right? like the 60 day cycles that we are talking about um, but yeah that is a little bit more difficult to predict it is easy on the macro time frame that's why it's so important that during this bull market when extreme optimism extreme euphorism is entering the markets and everyone is already positioned into the into the bitcoin space then that would be the moment that you got to ask yourself the question hey okay based on time we have seen a nice bull market the sentiment is extremely bullish and I think most people have already positioned themselves because I'm getting phone calls from my barber asking me to buy Bitcoin or asking me to buy this and this token. It's time for me to leave the markets and wait one or two years until we find that next bear market bottom and until we can enter again. This is the mission for this YouTube channel, guys. Make sure that you subscribe to this channel. Make sure to, that you have the bell notifications on because this is going to be our main focus. We are going to do intraday trading on the channel. I'm going to do daily uploads about the Bitcoin price, about altcoins. But the most important thing is, guys, that we at any moment can recognize where we are in the cycle and that in the next bull market, you know exactly when to to take profits at the same time or maybe even before smart money is going to do that guys if you enjoyed this video if you learned something smash up that like button that is very very much appreciated also really helps to boost this channel and to send this message to as much people as possible because this knowledge really should be available for every single one so for good karma make sure to leave that thumbs up button guys i want to thank you all from the bottom of my heart for watching this video i wish every single one of you a beautiful day and i hope to see every single one of you in the next video